Prime Minister says that with Namibia as a small economy and the government being an important stakeholder in the economy, the budget takes up a significant share of the country's gross domestic product. Through the continuation of government physical consolidation and reforms, she explained that by cutting the expenditure figures, government has to optimize economic growth to enhance revenue and at the same time also promote physical sustainability. When you consolidate, it, it means that you are spending less and uh, your impact on the economy would therefore be minimized. And uh, given the fact that the global environment is already subdued, that could have uh, the result of a more reduced growth and also exacerbated unemployment situation, at least in the short term. But we do realize that we need to continue with the consolidation, although we need to make sure that that does not result in completely um, minimizing the, the, the activities of government in the economy, because otherwise that can have uh, undesirable consequences for, for the country. Prime Minister also supports the Minister of Finance, Carlos Lechven's statement, where he urged accounting officers to ensure that budgets over commitment and unauthorized expenditures do not reoccur. These measures are not necessarily new because we already do have a public finance management system where accounting officers are held to answer for any unauthorized or over expenditures. That would continue to be the case. We have also indicated that uh, we would not only ask them to explain, but we want also to strengthen the accountability by ensuring that there are consequences, negative consequences for those that may overcommit the government uh, in such a way that uh, the, the stability of, of the financial stability of the, of the government is, is uh, disturbed. She added that at the same time, government will continue with the reforms to strengthen the system to minimize over expenditures in government.